Today we're going to be taking a look at one of my Grey Talon gameplays here. Pulling up the stats, 38 kills, 4 deaths, 136.9k damage. Absolutely insane. I don't think I've ever even seen anyone post damage numbers this high. Grey Talon post patch is absolutely bonkers. If you watched my guide from Friday a few days ago, I'll have the link to that in the description. You can take a look at that. But today's gameplay is just going to be more of a montage. We're going to get into the gameplay here. Huge charge shot there. Yeah, a lot of good work to keep the pressure on the Vindicta early. Massive charge shot over off on the Vindicta. To so get into a spot. There we go. Look at that. Using the rain arrows to fly forward. And we almost kill her with a charge shot. Tried to hit one there, but she does dodge out of the way. We're going to lay a trap back there just in case she ends up. Oh, and we hit her with another massive charge shot. The charge shots are so good for poking. Here she comes. Full health back. What can she do? She's going to eat another charge shot in the face. How about another one? Let's, let's do another one. There we go. Bam. For us, we just got our ult. Which is really good because if she gets low now, we can finally finish her off. We're gonna actually hit her with a couple beautiful charge shots, and there's the owl. Finish her off. First kill. And at this point, I don't know how she's gonna be able to handle us because our our charge shots are absolutely deleting her. If we have an owl to follow up, then it's pretty much game over for her. Ridiculous is still low here. She's only at like just under half her health, so there's a huge Q. And guess what? Our owl is off cooldown, baby. Get back here, Vindicta. You're out of here. Oh, what's going on, Pocket? You want some of this? Pocket tries to come in for the gank, but I don't think Pocket wants any of this either. Pocket's just getting poked down. There's a massive Q on the Pocket, almost eliminating Pocket as well. Pocket's got to run. All right, so we just picked up pretty big buy there. Spirit shield. And look at us shredding her. She has to drop because she can't handle the 1v1 midair. Now we just put out way too much damage. A huge Q off. We're 2v1 against the pocket. The pocket is sitting at like 10% health. We dig to get her health back up. She's trying to put a lot of pressure on me right now. A very skilled player, but that is a massive Q. Look at her health. Absolutely deleted. Sitting here with almost no health. She's gonna try to get away. Our owl is actually back. Let's see if we can take her out with the owl. Owl's flying down here. Where did she go? She's out of here. Our third owl kill. Vindicta's gotta be salty about that one. And there we go. At the 10 minute mark, we're able to take out the guardian. Pocket's still trying to take some heat. Pocket is absolutely just getting fried right now. Oh my God. Get out of here, Pocket. Deleted. Trying to take a 1v1 now. Actually, 2v1 pockets there, but look at the random arrows, man. I'm able to just fly away from that. Tried to gank me, but Reign of Arrows since the patch has been absolutely broken. You see how quick I'm able to get out of that sticky situation. All right, they're putting a lot of pressure on me. I got to back off. Let's see how we do. 2v1 here again. They do get our Guardian, but bam, baby, double kill. Was it worth it? I don't think so. Don't push on me. So Vindicta just got a, a double kill over there. We're going to see if we can clean up any of this. There's the Bebop. Bebop is running away. I don't know if we can catch them. There's another huge charge shot. And look, damage is absolutely just getting deleted on. Gonna end up finishing him off with the heavy melee. Uh, here we go. Another victim for the charge shot. Ah, we're gonna hit him with the owl, get the extra spirit damage. Another huge charge shot, just deleting the rape downfield there. And we take him out with our bullets. Do a massive amount of damage. Here comes the Medicta. Can we take her out for the thirst? She's running away pretty far. I don't think we can hit this. There's the Medicta. We're gonna push him by the, the Lash. Not gonna lie, that is a little bit scary though. Lash is kind of fed. So we're going to use our movement speed to get out of there. We have improved spirit right now. So that allows us to rotate super fast. Trying to find a victim. I don't think it's going to work out for us. We do take Wraith down to 
about half health and our teammate is able to follow up and finish that off that is still going to give us our stacks to protect this guardian they are moving in here lash again pretty pretty fed oh that wraith just absolutely deleted let's see if we take her out with the owl uh, i have no idea where she went one shot though brought that wraith all the way down to like five percent hp Absolutely deleted. Trying to get out. Here's the lash. Oh, a huge charge shot. And we hit him through the wall to secure a double there. And the pocket over here. Pockets on the run. Absolutely delete him in the back with the charge shot. And there we go. We got the boundless spirit. So now our spirit damage is absolutely insane. If you thought that the charge shots were hitting for a lot before, watch this. We move fast, and our charge shots are going to be hitting way harder. Pocket over here. Let's see if we can delete them. Oh my god. There goes your health. There's one. There's another shot. <laughs> You're gone. This Wraith, though, may not be so lucky. Gets walled off, and they're just absolutely deleted from our team. This guy has no follow-up, so unfortunate for him. And we are absolutely going to land a massive charge shot, and he's going to get taken out. Team's able to follow up on a lot of the damage. We were able to get them low. Pockets over here, kind of singled out. And we're just able to finish them off with a couple normal shots there. Ebop singled out down here. Gonna get him with a quick heavy attack. Big charge shot going off on there. Wraith gets hit again with the secondary charge shot. Trying to come in. But just deleted three charge shots landed. Health is out of here. So they're pushing in our walker here. Big charge shot off on the lash. Able to help kill the lash over there. Pocket now. Gonna get pushed on. Follow up on them. There we go. Take them up from behind. Movement speed with the rain of arrows able to get us back into position here so we can help push in with the team. Jabai coming up for us. We're gonna get the Mystic Reverb. Which is gonna help us follow up on a lot of our damage. Man, massive charge shot over on the Bebop. And the Reverb comes out. Doesn't quite kill him. We're gonna see if we can get them with the Owl. We can't find them, unfortunately. All right, off the respawn. Vindict is over here. Gonna try to get her with the owl. She is pretty good health, so we're not able to take her down. And I'm not 100% sure what she's using, but she's able to avoid a lot of my damage. Unlike the rest of the team. Ray's trying to push this in solo. Not gonna be a good idea. I didn't even hit that second shot. Just the Mystic Reverb was enough to take her out. There's the Lash, going to get a lot of pressure over on the Lash. This guy's going to try to all. We're just going to absolutely delete him. Does get stuck in my trap. Going to be unfortunate for him. And there we go. Delete him from behind. Put some pressure off over on the Vindicta because if we're not doing it, she's going to be putting pressure on our team. Dynamo's trying to put the pressure on our team. We're going to try to counter that. Here comes the Lash. We do get a massive Q off on the Lash. Gonna take his health all the way down to zero. There's a huge team fight still going on. Ah, uh, there's the alt again from the Bebop. We're able to avoid it. Ratchet gonna try to hit another Q off on him there, and we do take him out again. Bebop's alt is not effective when you got charge shots just deleting people. Dynamo trying to put some pressure on our team. We do miss our few first Q shot here, but we're hitting with a ton of damage from behind in the back. And he's trying to get away. No, thank you. Here's a Q shot. Luckily, we, we do miss that. We do hit the Bebop. And we hit the Vindicta. Two massive charge shots there. Put some pressure back on them. Another massive shot on the Bebop. Look at the health. You see that? The reverb just took him from... I think it was 40% down to about 10% there. All the way down to 10%. Now, the Nanimo's trying to come in to fight us. He's been deleting some of our teammates. He's hitting me with a lot of headshots there. I don't know if you heard that. Ding, 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 ding. 
Great aim from that Dynamo. We're just poking from a pretty safe spot here. We do enough damage that if one of our uh, charge shots hit, we pretty much the leading the team, so we don't really need to take too much of a risk. We're going to hit that Bebop over on the right. And one charge shot there is just like forcing the reset. Absolutely insane damage we're able to put out late game. All right, here comes the Wraith. Big Q shot over on the red. And the Mystic Reaver was able to take them down. Another big charge shot going there. Dynamo's trying to hit us from behind. We're going to try to take him out. He does hit me pretty hard there, but we're able to hit him with the Mystic Reverb. Trying to finish him off. We need one more charge shot. And there you go. A charge shot to delete him from behind. All right. So now we're going to try to run them down. Hit the Lash for a ton of damage. Reverb is almost going to kill him. There we go. Finally get him with the Reverb. Going to be able to finish off the Dynamo as well. Try to take out the Bebop, running him down. Where is he at? Here he is. Hit him a couple more times. Bam. Take him out with the charge shot. We actually do get the superior stamina. So that is going to allow us to synergistically work really well with our Rain of Arrows. Because look at this. Look how fast we get out now with the Rain of Arrows. Absolutely insane. All right. We're back in the fight. Going to hit that Dynamo. Immediately put some pressure on him. Oh, yeah. Get him out of here. Just delete that Dynamo. We see a couple people low there. We are just going to use this on the alt to counter it. Wait for that pocket to come out. Uh, and we absolutely just beam him in the back. There we go. He's taken out. Teammates able to follow that one up. A huge situation. All right. So they're trying to push in again. We're going to just let this pocket come in. We know he's going to ult. We're going to hit him with a massive charge shot. And it doesn't only just delete him. It, okay, it does delete him there. Massive owl there. Dynamo's trying to come in on us again. We are able to take him out. Gonna hit another charge shot over off on the Vindicta. Charge shot on the Vindicta. We finally take her out. We've been trying to do that all game. And now they're on the run. Bebop's trying to put some pressure on us. We're just gonna hit him over the top of the car there. We take him out. That's four of the teammates. We're gonna hit this Lash as he's trying to get out of here. We say, no, nah, you're gone too. That's five of them. Take out their whole team. Trying to run them down here. There's the Wraith, final member of their team. And we missed the queue, but we have another one lined up here. And they are going to go down. What a way to end it. Taking out the whole team. 136,000 damage. Just absolutely destroying on the new Grey Talon post-patch. It's been so much fun. I hope you guys check out the build video. Uh, this here, though, 38 kills. Four devs, 136k damage, over double anybody else in the lobby. Just absolutely nuts, dude. You gotta give this build a try. Check out my video, I'll put it in the link, and we will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Coach Jace, you out.